Huh. I got this old Deus too down here in this old site. Now this site dates back to before 1800. There was a town here and it's gone, okay? I spent a lot of time down in here with a Deus one, a Equinox, E-Track, and some more detectors. <clears throat> this field was tilled back in the spring, first time in a long time, okay? I don't know how deep it was tilled, but it was tilled, not disked. It had some kind of reed breaker pulled through it. Anyway, I'm in the park mode. Now, I'm not saying you should even hunt this site in the park mode, but I'm looking at the park mode right now. Reactivity 2, silencer is 0, no bottle cap turned on. I've got this signal here, Now I'm going to let you listen to it. Okay, you hear that right there? I'm getting like upper 60s, lower 70s. But that's not the important part you should pay attention to here. Let me see if I can get around here and show you what I heard to, to actually get on this target for best achievable detection, okay? And ID. Hear that right there? All I heard is that pop right there. That's what I heard in one of them tests I did in that barn in a previous video. Okay? Hear that little pop? And when I turn on that target over here, see what I get? Now, I don't expect this to be a very big target. It could be. It could be mass. I'm in full tone, zero disc. I'm going to dig this. We're going to see what it is. I'm down here in this old site. I've spent a lot of time with a lot of detectors. If I tilt my head back, you'll see that old elm tree there. And I'm playing around in the park mode here. Now, I'm not suggesting this is the best program to use in an area like this, but I've got this machine on 95 sensitivity. I've got a few airplanes flying around, but you, you hear that detector? That's pretty quiet. All right. I found one small non-ferrous, but it's sort of insignificant, but we're going to keep playing around here and see what happens. A little bit here, and I'm sweeping this detector, and I'm in full tones at zero disc. Just give you an idea of what this site is like. Most of what you're hearing in that thing is iron, okay? You hear all that? A lot of iron right here, boys, okay? I've spent a lot of hours in this area right here. This is one area where I can actually maybe judge a detector, see what it's doing that others won't do. See what that is. But that detector lit that thing up, boys, in the ground. It's a little hard for me to recover, though. I think I missed it going down the first time. Okay. You see, I tilt my head back. About 60 feet from me, it's three phase power, 95 sensitivity. I'm holding a call up in that direction. Park mode. It's pretty quiet. It's this old house here, and I've only dug one silver coin ever on this site right here, boys. One, okay? And I can't even tell you what machine I dug it with. It's a secret. But anyway, I have dug an Indian head penny here before. Somewhere right in this area right in here without any dragging it was deep, okay? Well, I've got this signal right here. Now, I've dug this plug out. And I'm getting a 90 in the meter. But this signal was chopped here at there. That's how it sounded before I took that plug out. I don't know what this is, but now we're going to see. 89 in the meter, 90. It was, I believe, boys. That screw right there. Hard to find, too. I dig this hole. Yeah, I found it. Still doing here. That ain't no recent drop. Wasn't very deep either. I didn't show you the signal, but uh, you can get a pretty good idea. I've been over this area right here a whole lot, boys, with a lot of detectors. I don't know what this is. It's a flashing 84 in the meter. <laughs> and 
Let's see what this is here. That may be it right there. What is that? Let's see if that's what it is. See it right there, whatever that is. That's what it is. <laughs>